So, any news at all? About Oren? He's been arrested. Finally, then. We don't have the report from ballistics yet. But if the guns turn out to be clean, man... Would they let him go? No, he'd do time for possession of unregistered firearms. But... But not for very long. They might bail him out, then, so he might go free. It's not that easy. Never mind that psychopath. Let's talk about something else. What is it? Nothing. Alex. What is it? Why are you giving me that look? Hey, Kareem. I don't mean to be rude, but I can't hold this back. You're turning out to be a real jerk, man. Alex, what are you saying? Watch your mouth, I man. watch my mouth just fine, man. What is it that you're doing, huh? Who are you, man? Who are you? Alex, shut up. I used to think of you as a man. I used to think that you were a decent man. What do you mean? I am a decent man. A man? What kind of man are you? You went off and married a rich girl just for her money? Alex, stop. Drop this right now. You sold yourself for money, man. You know it. And you know that a real man wouldn't do something like that, but you did it. Why are you playing with Anna? Why are you being a scumbag, Kareem? What the hell did you just say? <laughs> <laughs> Some nights I wake up and I see Kareem watching me. I pretend I'm sleeping. It's so peaceful to sleep on his chest. It's one of my favorite things, just to feel him there, next to me. Being loved by someone is great, Anna. Shall we go back? Are you bored? Do I bore you now? No, it's not that. I'm sorry, you had a recent breakup and you're very unhappy. And here I am telling you how happy I am, Anna. No, it's not that. You're sick. It won't do you any good. I'm so sorry, really. I didn't think about it. Forgive me. It's okay. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to... Celine, it's okay. It's fine. Anna! I get it! Kareem, Kareem! You are so in love! Anna! Do you know who Kareem is? He's my boyfriend! <laughs> Yeah, brother, you're right. I must look like that. It looks like I sold myself for some superficial garbage. For some money and a nice car, fancy clothes, a house in pool. Money? But it's not like that at all, man. I'm suffering. I'm suffering so much right now. But I can't say it to anyone. Tell me. You can tell me. You wouldn't understand, Alex. Why don't you try me, Kareem? Huh? Maybe I'll understand. We're childhood friends. Do you want to know why I married Celine? Because she's rich? Yes, but the real reason is... Celine? She's dying. What? She's ill. Lymph node cancer. So, I'm actually lower than you think now, aren't I? I'm just a scumbag who deceived a dying woman to get into her thinking that I really love her. And does Anna know about this? Yeah, she does. Yeah. Yeah. She's known from the start. But we just didn't have any choice, Alex. Please understand. You know the troubles my father brought upon me. I understand. I understand, but even though it's... I don't know. Uh... I can't stand it. I just can't. I have a guilty conscience, man. Celine's so innocent. She's just so good. She doesn't... She doesn't deserve to be dumped. Not now. I can't do it. 
but she deserves better than me. Kareem, did you really fall in love with her? No, it's not love, man. No, I... I pity her. When I look into her innocent eyes, I just suffer so much. I really do. She's just so innocent. She's just so good. Maybe it is... It's love. I don't know. I don't know anything anymore. I can't walk out on a woman who is so innocent and about to die. It's impossible. I can't do this. So then what will happen? Is she being treated? She is, but I don't know. I don't know whether it'll work or not. And the worst part of it all is that she doesn't deserve to die either. What about Anna? What will happen to her? Why do you, why do you still give her hope to Anna if you still can't leave Celine? Alex, Anna is my true love. Anna means the whole world to me, Alex. I can't live without her. But listen, Kareem, isn't this unfair to both of them? What? I'm sorry, but it is. You say you're in love with Anna, and that she is your life, but you're still together with a woman whom you can't seem to leave. I pity both of them, man. It won't work. It just can't. It just can't go on like this, believe me. It never goes the way you want it to. Eventually, you'll all suffer. To be happy, you have to make a decision. <laughs>